So I just went ahead and painted everything. Here's my handle. Here are my two crossbars. And here are the two bows. Really simple, I just painted them up. So now what I'm going to do is just put everything together. So I'm going to start by taking, first finding the belly side of the lid, which is here, locating the center, which is here, and the first crossbar is going to go just a little bit above center, maybe about an inch above center. So I'm just going to lash this here. So I'm going to show you how to do that. I'm going to start by just tying an overhand knot, putting that over the handle cross piece here, tying that fairly tight, coming back around and just doing a double knot. Or not a double knot, just doing the same knot again, just to double it up. Tighten on the first one, and tighten the second. Just like that. And I take the bow, find the center, go up about an inch from center. I start bringing it around. So I'm going to start by bringing this around the back side of the boat. If you can see, I'm bringing it around on the belly side to lay down over the handle piece. Bring it back around. On the back side there. Now I'm going, bringing it over this side, and then across the back side again. So really simple, I'm just basically crisscrossing over this. And you want to do this fairly tightly. So once you've got your four visible wraps on each section, you want to make sure it's nice and tight. Then you tie around the other side, and you basically now are alternating and tying the other way. All right. So once you've done that, you've got your completed wraps. You want to take this end here and actually wrap it down and under the wraps. See that? So you just want to kind of wrap along the side couple times. So about three or four times is good. And you want to go up to the end here. You want to make a loop. You see, I've made a little loop. And then you want to wrap over your loop. Once you've wrapped over the loop, you just pull the loose end through. And there's the finished wrap. So I'm just going to be doing this same wrap on all the other points. So I'm going to finish that up and I'll show you what that looks like. All right, so this is what the handle wraps look like. So here it is. I've also gone ahead and I've wrapped up the tips. What I'm doing is I'm making sure that there's about, I'd say about a half an inch to three quarter inch overlap. This will become the new tip of the bow because I'm going to be cutting these two sides away a little bit to form the knot. Same thing with down here. So now that these are done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut these and then I'm going to string this bow up. 